Mom and grandma lied about a COVID test ruining my wedding, TLDR. My mom and grandma lied about a COVID test and as a result, one third of our guests are sick, our honeymoon was ruined, and my relationship with both women may be unsalvageable. Apologies in advance for a long post. I am really struggling emotionally to process and move past the events of the last 1.5 weeks surrounding our October 5th wedding. Not sure what I'm looking for other than a platform just get this all out there because it's weighing heavily on me and my heart is broken. We just got back from our honeymoon in Mexico, which we spent a year saving for, and which was ruined after we tested positive for COVID while on the trip, as a result of decisions made by my mom and grandma, which I will detail below. About a year ago, my maternal grandma asked her cousin to officiate our wedding without asking me first. This was someone with whom I had no relationship and had only met once prior. I had no desire for him to officiate our wedding but went along with it because in our family, grandma gets what grandma wants or there's trouble. In fact, if you cross her, she will cry in her room, post something nasty about you on Facebook, and then write you off until you apologize, even if you've done nothing wrong, spoilers. Fast forward to one week before our wedding, we learned that the cousin slash our officiant and his wife had been exposed to COVID, and they were on their way to my grandma's house to stay for the week leading up to the wedding. My out-of-state parents and brother were staying there as well, and my dad and brother made the decision to get out of there to avoid getting sick and came to stay with my fiancé and me. We all voiced our concerns and made it clear to my mom and grandma that it was a bad idea to host people who had had a COVID exposure a few days before our wedding and were met with the most frustrating display of immaturity and selfishness by my grandmother and mom. My grandma started crying and saying they would all boycott our wedding if we were that worried about COVID, which in 2024 is just a cold. Absolutely zero attempt was made to acknowledge our concerns about public health at our own event. For some additional backstory, my maternal grandmother has always acted this way, and all four of her children blindly give in to her antics, but especially my mom. And all of them have displayed an extremely frustrating denial of science, which has gotten worse with the political conflict swirling in our family with the upcoming election. Anyway, my fiancé and I insisted that both our officiant and his wife take a COVID rapid test before we would allow them to come to the wedding. I contacted the venue and had a backup officiant lined up. I personally gave my mom two rapid tests and asked her to make sure both the officiant and his wife tested negative on Friday morning, the day of the rehearsal dinner. My mom texted me, The lepers are clean. I called her and asked point blank, Mom, do you swear that both our officiant and his wife tested negative? And she swore to me that they had. So, I called the venue and cancelled the backup officiant and we went ahead with the wedding weekend. Everything went perfectly. Our wedding was everything I dreamed of. The only tainted memories I will carry with me forever are the ones of my grandma acting cold and standoffish to me at our rehearsal dinner and the entire wedding day because I had the audacity to insult her. I'll never forget the way she treated me. Fast forward to the Monday after the wedding. We were headed to the airport to fly to Mexico for our honeymoon and caught wind from my mom that my grandma had come down with a cold. I told her to make sure she tested for COVID, as that would be the obvious assumption for anyone with two brain cells. We landed in Mexico and were just happy to be there to enjoy. Then everything fell apart. We found out while in Mexico that my grandma had hosted my other grandparents' dad's side for dinner the night we left while actively symptomatic and they were both now COVID positive. Then the truth slowly started coming to light and we learned that my mom had lied to me about our officiant and his wife both testing negative. Only our officiant had tested. His wife had the sniffles and they knew if she tested positive I'd disrupt their plans so they just didn't test her. I got more upset than I've ever been in my life and texted my mom that we were feeling completely betrayed and that, at the very least, my grandma owes an apology to my dad's parents for getting them sick. In return, I got a screenshot from my brother showing that my grandma had texted him. Tell your sister when I die, she can put selfish person who ruined my honeymoon on my headstone. All in all, 26 people are sick. More than one third of our guests. Some are very severely ill. My dad has it the worst. He called me last night to ask how to know it's time to go to the hospital for labored breathing. My mom is denying that she lied. My grandma is texting the entire family, trying to get them on her side, and I'm being told I'm overreacting because I'm brainwashed by the media. I had a meltdown on our honeymoon and just sobbed into my new husband's lap for an hour. I don't know how to move past this or whether I ever want to speak to my mom or grandma again. I feel like COVID aside, they chose to prioritize their own experience at the expense of nearly 30 other people, including us, the wedding couple. I will never forget this betrayal and I just don't know what to do. I'm mourning the aftermath of my own wedding.